So here's the second video. Um, I've just done notes in the lowest position, and now I'm going to move them up to the next uh, fitting notes. Can't call them inversions because they're all different. That was my C chord. I'm now going to put the C chord in that shape. I say shape, but I still want to know that's a G, and that's the fifth, and the third. That's my C chord. That's my G chord. That's my A minor chord. That's my F chord on the pull. And I know all I have to do is change the C to a D to get an E uh, D minor. There's my E minor. And again, try them in different um, orders, E minor, maybe to go into F, maybe going to A minor, maybe back to C, maybe to G, what about E minor, maybe try all the push ones together, and then all the pull ones. just get used to them in different orders and then you can start to link them through to the little exercises on that PDF. So the idea is not necessarily to um, play it at full tilt, but really listen to where the notes are. And you'll sort of get a confirmation from the left hand. So it's not about fluency necessarily yet, it's about making sure that you are learning the right notes.